Yeah, all know. right, let's get into this next match we have here. John Numbers versus Snakey. Oh, boy. Now, these two are, of course, both New York natives, and we do see them a lot. I haven't Plenty. seen Snakey recently no. uh, at Zeno, but we have her return and immediately meeting John Numbers here on the winner's side. Yes. Oh, I thought this was, is this a button warmer? Uh, for John Numbers, everything kind of looks like a button warmer. <laughs> he's just running around the stage, kind of just, yeah. you know, hanging off. Uh, now he's getting serious and bouncing Snakey around, yeah. and he gets Luma out of there real quick. For sure. One thing I'd say about this matchup, I, I do believe that it's Rosa Favor, I mean, kind of obviously. Mm -hmm. yeah. But one of, the, um, one of the interesting things is that normally, if let's say I'm a Mewtwo, right, okay. and I'm just charging Shadow Balls and throwing them and throwing sure. them, and Rosa just sits there with downbeat, like, she's perfectly content to do that. Sure. However, against Tweet, it, she heals by 2% every time she releases yeah, her first charge. It plays in. It, it does kind of play in because Rosa is still forced to approach. In a sense, yeah. I mean, or at least the Luma is. Yeah. Yeah. Definitely. I can see how this, um, how numbers as a player approaches this matchup. Yeah, see, he didn't, like, do a hard... Wow. Did you see that he was about to launch the ball with the charge shot thing? Oh, yeah. Numbers has all these, like, little tricky things. On. Yeah, he's such, such a quirky player. I think he's literally the only person in the world who knows how to do them. <laughs> yeah? Uh, but, man, just, like, there aren't many Wii Fit trainers, and he is a... He's the kind of guy who's a no. lab monster. He's, like, he's a lab monster. He's the only Wii Fit trainer, basically, like, that's notable in the world. <laughs> Uh, chat, correct me if I'm wrong. He's definitely the best Wii Fit trainer in America by like a million percent. So. Oh yes, absolutely. And we have here now these players just each kind of trading stage positioning, knocking the other one off and keeping them there. I love the high recovery yeah, from Snakey. It's necessary. But this forward throw is not going to do it. Numbers is known for his edge guards, so that makes sense. Oh, yeah, absolutely. Yeah, look how low Snakey is going, knowing John Numbers is a player. Oh, that was oh, so good. The Luma coverage. That was so good. The amazingly low recovery. That was like yeah. max distance for yeah. recovery. And then immediately does a ledge jump into down air to cover yep. numbers. Because numbers was like following him down. Yep, yep. Following. Well, like following. I said, you know, numbers yeah. and his edge guards. But now what we have as a result is uh, Rosa Luma both sharing their max rage. Oh, of course. So what I would like scary. to know is does Luma's uh, like damage scale with rage on Rosa? I'm, I'm pretty um, sure it would. No, no, only knockback is increased when it comes oh, okay, to Oh, okay, good to know then. With the exception of Lucario, every character does the same percent, uh, the higher damage. Ah, uh, uh, understood, understood. Uh, Still I pretty scary. I do want to point out that John Numbers is probably at kill percent from uh, like a Luma up air. Yeah? Uh, yeah I'd certainly, like at, like at the, yeah, the top, at the top of, like, of the stage, throw, yeah. Up oh, throw, up oh, throw, oh, throw, oh, oh, are you getting no. your Christmas miracle? <laughs> Uh, is, we might need to get that uh, that plush. Oh, uh, careful, careful. All right, so a lot, a lot of rolls. Yeah, just the, they're really kind of playing footsies right now, feeling each other out. Snakey gets that grab, oh. and Numbers is now in a position off stage, but he's, he's forced to recover. Yeah, Snakey does the, the instant snap recovery. Oh, my God. Whoa, whoa. Yeah. What was that? Snakey was looking for pivot grab, and Numbers just wasn't there. Oh, okay. Good I up love that aggressive oh, great numbers. tech, great tech. <laughs> oh, that's it. That, that was smart. Tilt is going to send up. We, we oh, are, we still got another stock. All right, just wanted to make sure we could see the players' reactions yes. just for that one. Good. That one KO. Let them know. Let them know. And, of course, this is – I I mean, of course, Snakey has a monstrous lead at the moment. Oh, yeah. But, of course, Numbers, who I believe is still our number one seeded player, yeah. he is nothing. He can – if he wants to, he can turn it up and yeah. take this back. Yeah. It just depends on whether he wants that – it that much, or whether he's just right now thinking about, okay, I have a game two and three to yeah. kind of focus on. Uh, you know, just give himself give himself some mental breathing room. It doesn't have to. Everything doesn't have to be 100% try hard, and that is good for your mental fortitude. It helps you like play against lesser players and know that you're not oh, yeah. going as hard as hell and then losing. It helps you play against the better players. Right now, we got two damn good players. Oh yeah, absolutely. <laughs> oh wow, that was so cool. So the ball like started to get pulled into gravitational pull. It ended up benefiting numbers a little bit more than just bouncing off the side of the stage, but uh, yeah. wow! All right, Luma batted wow. that right out of there. Oof. Luma took that hit okay. too. Okay, actually, this is—I was just living. about to say. Oh, <laughs> not living! Don't wow. press buttons in the blast zone. Yeah, you can see numbers reaction. You there. extend your hurt yeah. box. Don't. He, he, yeah, he knew that. He knew that he. I think he did. What was it? Side B? Or I, double? I, I, I think he did an aerial. Yeah, yeah, I it wouldn't it wouldn't have been side B. I think he I, I started to say like forward air or something. I don't know. Yeah. I think like his uh Rosal um I'm sorry, we fit yeah. trainer's like leg killed her. <laughs> like it yeah. just ventured into the abyss and there we go. All so, right, and we now see the stage switch instead. <laughs> he's given the two. He, two, he's like, This is game two. This, this is game, game two. two. Chat, if you didn't know, yet. now it's game two, so Alright, we have 
Numbers opting to go to Town and City, which is interesting. This is normally one of those classic Rosa stages. Because yeah. Her up, you know, because her up smash and also her up air can kill ludicrously early. Yeah. Um, I, well, I, I'm a little questionable of this pick. I think that Numbers just doesn't want to deal with Snakey living forever. I feel like yeah. he's confident in being able to like, because We Fit is one of those characters that. She has, I feel like she has certain kill confirms on this stage that she doesn't on any other. Because of the, the like small various platforms, platforms. You know, that, you know, this move will link into this move and therefore she's able yeah, to kill Yeah, well, them. platforms will often, often do that. Um, so, like, I also think that Numbers didn't want to deal with uh, Snakey on FD. Because, like, we saw already early on the stream, like, Snakey counterpicked to FD, knew what she was doing. And, yeah. You know, there, there's that. There's of the course. game, and then there, there's the there's the Smash game, and then there's the Mind games. Yeah. So we might have actually what might have happened was we might have seen a Smashville ban. Ah, oh, okay. Yeah, that makes a lot of sense. That, that would have made. And then I the didn't even think like, about it. Yeah. Yep. But anyway, getting back to this match at the moment, Snakey still has the lead Snakey's right now. Snakey's playing so safe. That's what it yeah, is. Yeah. Look, look. D no reason to approach numbers when Luma's dead. Yeah, of course. Yeah, instant to ledge recovery. Like, don't mess around with high right there. You have plenty of percent to work with. Of course. Oh, oh nice, I love that low fair. That was a Nair. He Nair, just, yeah, yeah. Low he Nair. landed with Nair. I think, I'm not just sure if he was going came for out. Yeah, that's the, that's the, one of the really cool things. I don't think it was a lunar landing, but Rosalina does have the ability to um, to uh, basically throw out a hitbox while also auto-canceling at the same time. It's nuts, Luma. man. It's ridiculous. It's I, like she's a top five character. <laughs> <laughs> it, oh. She's kind of good. And, and Snakey is no definitely Desi using her to the... Again, look, she so be. safe. And that beautiful no down is going to oh, take the stop. Oh, wow. Oh, wow. Numbers. And Glove world. <laughs> also, I do want to talk briefly about players. Numbers is talking about Salt. He is a very emotional player. Yes. And being knocked out this early by Snakey can seriously mess with him. And he's worried can, about that right now. It can tilt someone pretty hard, you know. Um, and Snakey is not, like, playing infuriatingly lame or anything. I think Snakey's just playing anti-John numbers, like, as a result yeah, oh, of their history. Wow. wow. Shut me up. That was awesome. All right, we have down numbers. Air. Oh, down and air. Down and air then again. down air again. And then a back air. No, he had no jump. Oh, and the bad. Oh, yeah. misses the tech. And she was using her jump in order to continue the aerial swing. Yeah, yeah. And so that's why she ended up getting caught underneath with no jump. And she didn't have time to uh, get to get, get what she wanted, yeah. yeah. So, unfortunately right. for uh, numbers, um, Snakey's coming back with a fresh Luma. Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> and this becomes difficult again. And, of course, I just want to say I love, love, love Snakey's ledge trapping at the moment. Like, you see numbers get stuck on ledge, and then he is stuck on ledge. Oh, yeah. I, th I think almost all but one of Snakey's kills so far, if I, unless I'm mistaken, Have been, has been at the ledge. Yeah, more or less. Like, we saw F Smash, F -smash at ledge in a pre previous set. And oh, it was, it was the down air. It down air. Uh, but anyway. Uh, and I do want to say yeah. also, Numbers is a, is a player that notoriously, he loves to go to the ledge. It's his second home. Yeah. And so if your opponent Ooh, is... Oh, amazing! Custom combos. And there it is. That's it. That's the lead for Numbers right now. Yeah. kind of Numbers... Even it up. Need to approach in a way. Uh, now he needs to approach because you know Luma's gone. If you don't do anything, you mean there. Snakey? No, 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 numbers. Yeah, yeah. numbers yeah. should approach because Luma's that's gone. And if, if, if you want to take advantage of that, yeah. Oh my God! Oh, oh, great amazing tech, tech and, and the footstool. footstool. But oh, I don't. I don't think he had legend oh visibility, but I wasn't sure. I don't think Snakey was I, aware. Yeah, that was that was. I think it was just very tenuous situation. Yeah. I gotta say, that one combo has breathed here, yeah. new life back into John Numbers. And this game in general. They were playing footsies for like minutes. Oh, yeah. Here we go. Well, here we, we go. Numbers back on ledge. Let's see. Pressure ish ledge, ledge situation. Oh, my. Oh, the, the pressure oh, right now with Luma. And it's so safe because it's, you know, Rosa is nowhere near. near. And right Chat. now, like. Numbers Ch has to. Oh, and there's the crab. Oh, is it gonna oh, go for it? Oh, but release. Oh, it Mash. doesn't work. The mashed potatoes. All right. Get back to ledge. The whole venue is popping off right now. Games have stopped. This yeah, is this tense. This could be huge. I don't think Snakey's ever taken a game from numbers. That's not a single a game. So this would be Wait, no, a set, a rather. I think. I believe. I'm not sure. If it's taken. Perhaps games and friendlies, but even so, this could be uh, huge spamming right now. Down B. Here we have numbers at Get the ledge. Down there. Oh, so smart to come up with that up there, and that oh. that will do it. Oh, Clutch. and we have Snakey. She had that game, and numbers just. He, it was like he breathed new life back into oh, himself. Yeah. He got that one combo, and all of a sudden it went from like, you know, him at like 80 and Snakey at 20 to all of a sudden he is the lead now. Yeah. And he was just like, I have the lead. I, I'm John Numbers. I can do this. Yeah, John's and then just literally stacking on the numbers. 
He's hitting him. He's hitting him. You know, he's, he's, he's hitting this yeah. poor Luma. But we do have game up. three. We cannot forget game three. However, momentum has completely reversed now. John Numbers is clearly feeling himself. He's he's on a roll at the moment. And Snakey is going to need to absolutely disrupt that. Well, in order that's to why she's chugging monster. So hopefully Snakey becomes a monster and, you know, can redeem herself in the following game. Shoutouts to monsters. Shoutouts to monster. Sponsor us. Yeah. Monster sponsor. That would be nice. All right, guys. Game three. All right, and, and we where got do we it. have it? Dreamland. Here in Dreamland. I do know that Snakey loves to counterpick the Dreamland. I love this stage. Um, just straight up. The, like, no bearing on anything. I just really like this stage. Oh, absolutely. It's a pretty stage. I mean, I love this stage solely because it has the Fountain of Dreams theme on it. Yes. <laughs> oh, one of the best soundtracks in any Smash game period. In any game period, honestly. Yeah. I Street, I uh, uh, chat, what is your favorite soundtrack in Smash? In Smash 4, let's just keep it to that. I mean, that's what yeah. we're watching, right? But what is your favorite stage and your favorite uh, soundtrack on it? Yeah. And who's your favorite to win this set? All right, uh, another grab this. release. I, oh, it, sounds, okay, okay. it sounds at least like the crowd is in Snakey's favor. We hear a little bit of a collective. Human you know, condition like, to oh. cheer for the underdog. That's what it is, man. And right now, she uh, does have that lead. I mean, yeah, if it's just by 1%. <laughs> Yeah. Okay. Hopefully you can extend. Oh, oh calm my, down. This could calm be down. so scary. This is numbers, numbers on edge. Good fall through platform. That was so interesting from numbers. He knew that there wasn't really any way for him to get like a real punish off of that low recovery from Snakey. Mm -hmm. So instead he opted to use his hula hoops to try and catch Snakey on the way up. But it almost backfired on him. But he managed to get out unscathed and just huge damage onto Luma. Not dead quite yet, but I think probably another love tap will do it. That's what we're really seeing this uh, this game, not necessarily the set, is pot shots, love taps, and, and hit and runs, you know? And oh, yeah, these absolutely. These characters both um, cater very well to defensive play styles. Of course. And the players cater pretty well to defensive play styles. More so John Numbers, I think, than Snakey, as per Snakey yeah. kind of having a zero suit now. Oh, but, yeah. Yeah, as we saw on stream round one, didn't exactly pan out. But what is panning out right now is Snakey's lead. It's 1-1. One, one. Snakey's up by 11%. Um, and she does have the counter pick right now. And she does, yeah. So, and we saw that. Oh, that was such a good roll read. Um, yeah, good stuff. That was the double up smash hit. There right? it is. That's Nasty. up air. Some big damage right now. Wow, again. Oh, that probably would have killed if both hit. Oh, yeah. Oh, I love that forward air. Just putting pressure on numbers Ooh, while he's on these platforms. Beat out the that ball. Was, that was kind of a bait from numbers. Yeah. Throws out that ball. Knows that, like, people are hungry to hit it back oh, yeah. to him. They're like, it'll be so cool if I hit this back yeah. at him, and nah. then he dies. And he's just like, I I know my own ball. <laughs> yeah. Stream, might I say, you all have some fantastic music picks. I'm pretty also, I'm also pretty partial to Fire Emblem main theme, so shout outs to Josh, the elite gamer. It's a good one. Oh, hi, Josh. Uh, <laughs> hi, Josh. <laughs> hi. Uh, oh, ooh, Luma trades. covering a little bit. Mini DBZ. Yeah. And at uh, this point, it's There's scary at this so point. So many items. Yeah, it's scary at this point because the release Rosa has a lot more just overall kill power. Yes. Then Lu but and as soon as Luma disappears, then it becomes a little scarier because now how look, is... Look at numbers trying to heal. Look, oh, yeah. They already healed 4%. Ooh, F2. That forward tilt not Relax. killing just yet, but oh my God. Luma's so close at Rosa's the moment. Rosa's so light. <gasps> oh! That ball the getting ball. hit, but doesn't really again? do much other than keep him, her off. But she's now sitting at 136%. Ooh. This is definitely... Um, okay, Luma está muerte. All right, what do we got? Okay, going to get Four. a forward throw. No, beautiful matchup from numbers. No, oh, I don't that think near. I've seen Sneaky actually do a throw. It's all been these brawl-esque grab releases. Okay, let's see if we get forward this time. Forward throw, there we go. Not no. gonna kill, but we do have it's extremely last hit right now. Can I direct everyone's attention? Oh! Walks away from it, and as she turns, she Let couldn't. Let me stop. Oh my god. She couldn't shield as she was turning, <laughs> and that's why she got hit by that neutral B. And then there, Livin? not gonna Livin. do it. Okay, we have there's Livin two minutes and 30 seconds left. Okay, it's very possible oh. numbers goes for a timeout. It's I, I don't even the know what's gonna happen. The whole venue is losing. Their feces oh, right now. Oh, and there now. it is. There it is. Luma's going down there. Oh, but Snakey manages to call her back. <laughs> oh my gosh, this is so tense. And we're. S oh, oh, Luma got sent, blasting off again. Yeah, and now we see. I I think numbers might be okay with going for a timeout. Back throw, up throw. Up throw. When uh, would you ever see a Rosa doing uh, up throw? She didn't want to stay alive at the back throw. No, that, that makes throw. sense. It's just like wow. <laughs> All uh, right, let's see this now. Uh, oh, and finally wow, reads the, the read. Roll. Okay, but the gets double the read. Smash. Yeah, so yeah. red on the roll up and then red on the roll in. Oh yes. my gosh. And we have now this Snakey's is so once again even and now oh. Snakey with the lead once again. Snakey's going to get cheeky. Only, 
We no. only have a minute and 40 left on the clock. I I'm not sure if these players might... are aware of it, but like this could definitely go to timeout. And if not, these players have to be aware of it. If Numbers ends up with like a 30% yeah. deficit, Ooh. he has to seriously Careful. worry about his approaches. Everyone oh is going crazy, chat. And we all wish that you and could be here. This is numbers. nuts. Okay, oh we're, we're ticking down. And I just want to reiterate how huge this would be for Snakey, this win. She has never taken a set from numbers. numbers. Not to and there's that huge oh combo we saw man. game two. That's what allowed numbers to really push momentum back I don't back think in numbers corner. realizes the clock because he's going in and, and, and he's up by like 30 something percent, 40 oh, something percent. This so. is bad. 50 yes. steps. I'm oh, not no, sure he's I just did. putting in work on Luma. Oh, he missed that. Oh, okay. wow. Nice snipe. Luma's and dead gone. Luma. Okay. And Snakey's now we have panicking. a minute left on the clock. And numbers is, definitely... is just doing yoga. Oh, forward tilt. Sending Rosa off oh, stage. Man. This is looking really grim right now for Snakey. It's 40 seconds till pencil's down. It's not going to be good. Okay, we got the back throw. Let's see if some type of edge guard situation. Oh, get that ball out of here. Oh, oh no. no! She went too deep. Oh. She knew the clock was there. She Poor knew that K. she didn't have a lot of time. I, I know exactly what she was going Chat, for. Chat, what do you make of this? <laughs> there are people in the venue that don't even play Smash that are popping off.